No beakers, no labs, no chemicals, no reagents, just pure science. The magic of which is that you can see it anywhere and everywhere. This is the live thing for us in the back. As you can see here, we have water boiling. This is not out of the ordinary. This is because we put in the water before the pan started heating up. So as the pan got hotter and hotter, the molecules got more energy to eventually turn into steam. And as you can see, now that I'm done talking, the water is almost done evaporating. Now we're getting down to the action. As you can see, the water is hovering over the surface as the steam forms a cushion between the surface and the water and it just hovers over, taking much longer than normal to actually evaporate. In previous years, the light and frost effect hasn't been very useful. This is simply because it is a very inefficient way of heating and interferes with the heating mechanisms. So people just disregard it almost like an anomaly. However, recently, students from the University of Bath found an ingenious solution for this effect. They made a thermostat with no working parts whatsoever. The design consisted of a metal block with serrated edges and a dropper that dropped blobs of water consistently. Now, when the temperature of the block was a bit too high, the blobs would go in one direction, and if it was too cold, it would go in another, until they would find the perfect balance and go straight ahead. Hope you enjoyed this video from Vidan and Abdallah, and now we shall show you some footage of pure light and frost effect. Hope you enjoyed.